Today we're flying from here in Denver Centennial Airport to Prescott, Arizona. It's gonna be an awesome flight. About an hour and 45 minutes up in the air, 43,000 feet. The right seat's open, could be my co-pilot. Let's go flying. everyone, welcome on board. Let's go flying. Fry this up here and uh, rock and roll. Ignition. Good fuel flow, oil pressure's coming up. And the relay's out. Good stabilization. Wait for the cast. There we go. And number two. two. And two. And use the fuel. Out. Speed brakes are up and down. Ice protection systems not need avionics are set. We're going to be uh, on the uh, Teru 2, should be the uh, Wings 1 departure Teru transition. Going to maintain 250 knots or graded until reaching 10, uh, upon reaching 10,000 feet, which we can do. Let's reset 10,000 feet once we get to 250 once we get to 10. 8,000 feet is bug, clearance 6576 is in. After uh, Teru, it was uh, direct Montrose, direct Drake, direct Prescott. That is in. Sure. All right, takeoff data is posted. Avionics are checked and set. Elevation set for Prescott, 5,000 feet. Messages are normal. Afterbiter is open, just me on board today. And pack safety, which is not required. Let's go. Centennial Ground, Skylane 331, Gulf Whiskey's at Charlie 1 with Echo, looking for departure to the southwest. Great service here, always by TAC Air at Centennial. They just do a great job, and, and all the, the guys and girls that work here just do awesome. So, thanks so much. All right. Centennial Ground, uh, no, Skylane 5239, Mike off at Bravo 8. Cash lights uh, coming to the hotel. Skylar Cadal, face to ground, taxi parking via Alpha. Uh, taxi Alpha, I'm just in there, Ground, hello, citation 2 Romeo Foxtrot, TAC Air, Delta Taxi. Who's the TAC Air ready to go? Yes, sir, citation 2 Romeo Foxtrot. 2 Romeo Foxtrot, still on ground, pull up to hold short of taxiway Alpha. Pull up and hold short of Alpha, 2 Romeo Foxtrot. Medivac 902 here, Mike, no clearance stored at all in that call sign. All right, pull up and hold short of all Alpha right, we'll here. Go. I'll go refile it. But that just remain the frequency and uh, let me know, or I'll let you know when I see it. Okay. All right, taxi lights, good. Brakes are definitely tested. Nose wheel steering was moving. Flangements are good. Rudder bias will do once we get moving here. Before takeoff, ISO systems not needed. Pass seats, my seat belts are on. My seats are good. No one else on board. Flaps 15, indicating 15. Speed brakes are down. Garm button is set. Will be nav and. Remember uh, two Romeo Fox, turn left on uh, taxiway Alpha. Can you accept Alpha 4 intersection? There'll be 8,100 feet available from there. 
Uh, yes, sir. We can accept uh, Alpha 4 uh, or 2 Romeo Foxtrot. 2 Romeo Foxtrot. Hold short. 17 left at Alpha 4. All right. So uh, 17 left, Alpha, Alpha 4, uh, 2 Romeo Foxtrot. 2 Romeo Fox, you monitor tower now in 18-9. We'll see you. 18-9. I'll see you. Thanks. 2 Romeo Fox. All right. Clear left, clear right. We needed 5,900 feet. We need. We have 82. We got plenty of buffer, plenty of of room to work with. 189. Here we go. Left, report Parker and Rafa, if you're familiar. Left, seven left, and Parker. Rudder biased. Adrian Mike. Station two, my Fox Tail Tower. Run one seven left, Alpha four, clear for takeoff. Fly away heading. Alpha four, one seven left, clear for takeoff. Fly away heading. Citation two, Romeo Foxtrot. All right, left is good. All right, before takeoff, taxi checks, everything is completed. We're runway heading, one seven left, clear left, clear right. Alpha four, one seven left, here we go. Lights coming on. Clear right, final is clear. Number three three one golf whiskey. Peter's Center, coming on. Left off four line of point. Uh, line up and wait. Alpha four three three one golf whiskey one seven left. Where am I heading? Heading select. Here we go. Stable takeoff. Takeoff power is set and achieved. Two good engines. Airspeed alive. Both sides. Seventy knot checks. One, rotate. Positive rate. One golf whiskey. You're up. Clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff at Alpha Four. One seven left. V two plus ten two flaps up. Your damper. Two Romeo Fox kind of torch. Good day. Two Romeo Fox shot. Damper departure. Hello. Citation. Two Romeo Fox shot. Sixty three hundred. Climb to eight thousand. Runway heading. Station zero, Romeo Fox, head down to Park Shutter, contact. Climb and maintain one, two thousand. Turn right, heading two eight zero. Okay, one two twelve thousand. Right turn, heading two eight zero. Two Romeo Fox, trot. Heading select twelve thousand feet. Climb power. Autopilot. All right, so we'll start accelerating here to two hundred knots. We're not going to have it in VNAV just for now. VS here for a bit. Go about 1,500 feet per minute. Should be good. Whew, that sun's bright. All right. After takeoff, gears up, flaps are up, throttles are climb, climb detent, lights are good, pressurization's coming up, looking really good. So the Bravo is 10,000 feet, so it's 200 knots uh, below the Bravo, so we'll put 200 knots for now until we get to 10,000 feet, and then once we're at 10,000 feet, we'll go to 250 knots. All right, there's 10,000 feet, we're in the Bravo, accelerate 250 knots now, 250 knots. So start pitching down. That is looking beautiful. All right, 1,000 to go. Number two, Romeo Foxtrot, contact departure 126.1, see ya. 261, two Romeo Foxtrot, see ya. Metamax 73 Alpha, flighting 180. 180, 170. Demo departure, hello, citation two Romeo Foxtrot, 11.5, coming 12,000, 280 heading. That is two Romeo Fox, short Denver departure, good afternoon. Climb and maintain flight level 230. Climb and maintain flight level 230, two Romeo Fox Strat. 230 is set, 250 knots. We're in flight level change, 250 knots. 12 heavy, proceed right Zimmer. Beautiful. Zimmer, Here we go. All righty. That was, uh, was kind of fun. Quick departure, getting out of there. Shout out to Centennial. Or, always the controllers do a great job. And uh, yeah, that worked out really, really well. Might be a little bit uh, bumpy over the Rockies here, so make sure you have your seatbelts on. I always love, heavy love flying in this part of the, part of the country, it's just the best. Challenging in certain aspects, uh, some different things to have to think about compared to flying in the East Coast, but a lot of fun.
and uh, it's always interesting. We have a speed restriction south of 6198. Okay, Roger that. Seven number two, Romeo Foxshot, proceed direct Baylor on course. Direct Baylor on course, citation two, Romeo Foxshot. All right, Baylor, activate nav. Departure south of 4842, And that's, I think, the really cool thing about the three plus, right, is on departures like this, you know, 250 knots, no issues. And we can maintain that and climb at a very respectable 2,000 feet per minute. Yes, sir, we're Full fuel, sure. it's hot out. I'm not a problem, um, so 5842, and I guess uh, just for paperwork, I didn't for me. Really, uh, really good stuff. Southwest 6198, contact Denver Center, 128.65, good day. 2865 for Southwest uh, 6198. Number 2, Romeo Fox, try contact Denver Center, 128.65, good day. 2865, 2 Romeo Fox, good day. All right, 18,000 feet. We'll go standard on the altimeters, 29 or 9 or 2. Southwest 6198, Denver Center, 132, 3285, we'll see you at Southwest 6198. Denver Center, good afternoon. Citation 2 Romeo Fox, at 185, coming at 230, 250 knots. 2 Romeo Fox, Denver Center, resume normal speed and maintain flight level 240. Maintain flight level 240 and normal speed. Citation 2 Romeo Fox, thanks. All right, we'll go VNAV now, so we'll go back into our VNAV planning, which is 222 knots in the climb. Look at that, see? That's cool. Beautiful. Wow. So we're going to have a little bit of uh, weather to deal with, uh, dodging some, uh, some buildups and some storms coming into, uh, coming into Drake. Always a good thing. Even in the cruise out of here. Romeo Fox, Sector Direct Tayru, and then direct to uh, destination. All right, we appreciate that. Direct Tayru, and then direct Prescott Airport to Romeo Foxtrot. All right, so direct Tayru, activate that. Tayru is activated nav, making that turn. Now we're going to delete Montrose, delete Drake, and uh, now we have Tayru, direct Prescott. Beautiful. So, yeah, so always if there's some sort of weather or something uh, at your destination. Uh, you know, once you get cleaned up and on departure, start, you know, thinking ahead, thinking ahead, you know, what are you, what, what's our plan going to be in Prescott? Are we going to go right, yeah, left, so around the weather? You know, what's 13, the picture? And start building a picture in your head. And I think that sort of thinking ahead and, and thinking 10 steps ahead is kind of what I think you have to do in the jet world. So, up to Prescott. Romeo Fox, uh, looks like five minutes for higher at least. Citation to Romeo Fasha. Roger that, no problem, thank you. All right, so we'll be level at 24 for about five minutes. Cool. Direct to Romeo Fox, direct to Direct Prescott Airport. Direct Prescott Airport, citation to Romeo Fox, All right, so we're level here at 24,000 feet for the next five minutes or so per air traffic control instruction. Um, if you are on Instagram, I do have an Instagram account, citation max and the number one. We be super appreciative if you would uh, give that a follow. Super fun. Uh, we do kind of vloggy sort of style 30, 30 seconds, stuff day to day of uh, kind of staying in the loop on, on where I am. And we just did an Instagram live earlier today, and it's a lot of fun, and I really enjoy it. So okay, if you are on Instagram, love to give uh, love you to give it a follow. Timber approach on one two zero point three five. FedEx 30, 36, right. Denver Center, 132, cool. 25. So 240. 32, 85. Celery. So you get it too. 32, 85, FedEx 30, 36, All right, cool. You down to 339, FedEx to Delta. Well, it's probably going to be uh, a little boring for the next uh, 45 minutes or so, so we're going to turn off the cameras for a bit, and we'll uh, throw them back on for our arrival into Prescott, uh, Arizona. So, talk to everyone a little bit. All right, we are back. We're deviating for weather, about uh, 20 degrees uh, to the right for about, uh, we've been on this heading for about 65 miles. Thank you, contact LA Center on 135.25 if uh, you would let them know that as so well. So that's what we're going on. We got the next rad uh, weather data link coming in, so that's what we got there. Uh, I did have the, uh, the weather radar up a little bit ago. Kind of see that on top, and then we got, uh, we put the weather radar on. Start warming this up again and that will start painting a picture 
as we are descending. Again, good tools to have for sure. Especially with the altitude compensation tilt, it will tilt uh, compensate for your altitude, which is uh, which is nice as well. So, GPS Sinky runway three right, approach new, landing runways three right and three left. Outbounds advise ground control direction of departure. Inbounds contact tower one two five point three. Nose to airman. Taxi waves echo one, echo two, center line. All right, so RNAV three right is what they're one, doing. Two, end identifier light. And that works support. out well. West ramp close except Emory Riddle aircraft. South ramp close the transient aircraft. Advise on initial contact. You have Mike. Mike. Okay. So we're going to plan the uh, RNAV runway three right. The RNAV Yankee three right is no PV approach. So it's lateral and uh, vertical guidance. So it's just like an ILS approach. Really, really good stuff. So approach briefing here, it's the RNAV Yankee uh, runway uh, 3 right approach. Final approach course 0 to 8, so WASP approach. Golf D is the uh, final approach fix there at uh, 72, excuse me, 8100 feet. And we'll go down to the minimums of uh, 5311. That's 289 feet above the ground. So 5311, we'll put that in. Is set, mints are set both sides. Yeah, so my plan is here to kind of go on the west side. Um, there is some, still some lightning on the, uh, so let's see how it would look here. So we could go like this, see if it actually would work out uh, another five miles or so and it should work out really nicely. All right, so we're waiting five miles for that uh, landing data. Runway three right, we'll load it up. The runway is dry now, just some thunderstorms in the area. Looks good, we got 7200 feet available, flaps 35, anti-ice will be off, the factor is standard. And 114, 105, we need 3400 feet, and we have 7200 feet, so that's good. Accept the speeds, and they're posted. And Denver, to Romeo Foxtrot, we're turning left now, direct Prescott. To Romeo Foxtrot, thank you, contact Albuquerque, Thunder now, 127.67, have a good day. 127.67, to Romeo Foxtrot, have a great day, see ya. Number one, Foxtrot Romeo, contact Phoenix Approach, 120.7. 20.71, Foxtrot. Alrighty. Albuquerque Center, hello, citation 2 Romeo, Foxtrot, level 280, left turn direct, Prescott Airport. Number two, Romeo, Foxtrot, Albuquerque Center, rider, moderate to extreme precipitation, uh, moderate to heavy precipitation, he's out of course, and he's, uh, I think about 20 miles north of Prescott. Center maintains on level uh, 240. Copy that. Down to 240, citation 2 Romeo Foxtrot. All right, level 240 is in, head down. So we're going to be going Number right six, here. Romeo, the FBO is. So if we land right three right, plan to probably exit Delta 4 or Delta 5, and then take Delta. We'll turn runway 30, and then get a crossing echo in to the FBO. So that looks good. And center to Romeo Fox, requesting about 20 degrees right for weather. One Romeo Fox trot right, correction two Romeo Fox trot right, deviation approved when able direct Prescott in the bus. All right, right approved when able direct Prescott to Romeo Fox, appreciate it. Okay. All right, so we're gonna start that, just to avoid some of that heavy precip over there. About 20 degrees to the right, so it's good. Yeah, no ice, 1,000 to go. Number two Romeo Fox trot, descent and maintain one 4,000, the Prescott altimeter, sorry, Flagstaff altimeter 3026. Okay, 3026, this had to maintain 14,000 to Romeo Fox. Okay, 143026 on the altimeter. Get that standby once we pass 18,000. Number two, Romeo Fox track, contact Albuquerque Center, 128.45. 2845 to Romeo Fox, I see ya. See ya. Albuquerque, hello, citation to Romeo Fox, shot level 230, descending for 14,195, uh, heading deviating for weather. To Romeo Fox, at Albuquerque, Center, Roger, thank you. Looks like maybe 30, 40 miles or so before you can make it back on course uh, from continuous light, south flight turbulence with that. To Romeo Fox, I appreciate it. All right, so we're looking good. Anytime the... Uh the uh, ram air temperature, the RAT, is below uh, 10 degrees Celsius. The uh, engine ATI has to, to be on. That's why it's been on for quite a bit. Clouds. And that can cause some issues because uh, it does take, obviously, uh, engine performance, take an engine, hot engine, uh, bleed air. So if you're climbing out uh, and you're in the you know 30s and uh, 40,000 feet uh, sort of area, 
Uh, that's something to think about and run the performance charts because you might not be able to climb up to 45,000 feet with the, uh, the engine anti-ice switches on. Uh, en engine and wing, anti wing engine anti-ice switches you definitely can't, but even sometimes uh, the engine uh, anti-ice can cause uh, some issues with the climb. So we do have a cell that uh, just actually popped up to the uh, south of the airport, so we're going to try and get in before that uh, appears. Right now it's in a good, uh, good position, so we'll see what happens. We have to hold, we got to hold. Oh. Romeo Fox, what's your sign, Uh Yes, ma'am, uh, 14,000, Romeo Fox, Romeo Fox, thanks, press it up, come to 3016. 3016 to Romeo Foxtrot. 3016 is in. So, I know one popular question and comment that uh, everyone always says is, fix that visor. Plane's out of annual and uh, we have a brand new whole visor piece. So this all got replaced and the visor. So uh, we shouldn't have any uh, more issues with, with the visor flopping around. Okay, now we're picking up some ice on the windshield here. And we're getting some ice on the wings. So we're gonna put the wing Wings on and the tail. So our full system is uh, is going to be working now. And center citation to Romeo Foxtrot. Romeo Foxtrot, go ahead. Uh, picking up, it looks to be some uh, light rime, potentially mixed, out of about 17,000 feet. Uh, outside air temperature is uh, minus 12. Here, Romeo Foxtrot, Roger, thank you. Romeo Foxtrot, contact Phoenix approach, 133.57, thank you. 3357 to Romeo Foxtrot, good day. Approach, hello, citation to Romeo Foxtrot, 14-3 descending to 14,000, deviating on a 195 heading for weather. Citation to Romeo Foxtrot, Phoenix approach, Roger, expect vectors, Arnav Yankee, runway 3 right approach. Arnav Yankee for 3 right to Romeo Foxtrot, thanks. All right, so tail is going to come off now. Hunters 2, Romeo Foxtrot, fly heading 170 when able, and descend now and maintain 9,000. Okay, 170 heading now, we're doing that down at 9,000, Romeo Foxtrot. All right, 170 and 9,000. Yes, it's good. Here we go. So I don't think he's going to vector us uh, out to uh, Mumty, so let's uh, go ahead here and go Procedures, Activate Vectors to Final. And uh, it's ready to switch over to LPV, so that's good. Not sure if it's coming from the cameras, but you can see that big nasty cell right up there about our 2 or 3 o'clock. Wouldn't want to fly anywhere near that. Wow, beautiful though, once you get past the clouds. Got a rainbow down there. Cool. All right, so everything's looking good. Looking for the airport. I don't see it yet. It looks to be at our about 12 o'clock, 15, yeah, 12 o'clock, about 15 miles. 1,000 to go. All right, capturing 9,000 here. We're gonna put the plate, the approach plate on the uh, PFD, so we'll just go that and put RNF 3 right. Fetters 2, Romeo Foxtrot, Prescott Airport, 11 o'clock, 15 miles, reported in sight, if able. 2, Romeo Foxtrot, lucky. Citation 2, Romeo Foxtrot, we have the airport in sight. Fetters 2, Romeo Foxtrot, great. Crid visual approach, oh, runway 3 right. Alright, uh, crid visual approach, 3 right. Citation 2, Romeo Foxtrot, thanks. Alright, fighter's coming off. Clear the visual. There is it, right there. So that actually works out really well, keeps us away from this weather. And uh, yeah, we're good to go. Station 2, Romeo Foxtrot, contact Prescott Tower, 125.3. 253, Citation 2, Romeo Foxtrot, have a great day. Great day. That's good, Tower, hello, Citation 2, Romeo Foxtrot, about 12 out for a runway 3 right. So there's two Romeo Fox, Prescott Tower, good afternoon, runway three right, clear to land. 
Clear to land, runway three right, citation to Romeo Foxtrot. Beautiful, start slowing it down now, approaching the Delta. And below 200 knots, flaps 15. Beautiful evening, clear. Look at this, you can see for 100 miles. All right, gear's coming down. Tower to Romeo Fox, front of front, there's traffic landing, three left, and we're still clear land, three right. Station two, Romeo Fox, up from the Cessna passing the tower is landing runway three left. Got it, thanks, uh, to Romeo Fox, I appreciate it. So. Alright, so we're going to just uh, switch this to runway 3 right, to activate that, cool. Here we got gear down 3 green, let's go below 161, flap 35, landing checks, speed brakes are down. Here, gear down 3 green, no red, flaps 35. We're clear landing runway 3 right, speed's coming down, and we'll wait for the yaw dampener, that's it. Always good to keep a little extra speed here on the turn to final. Three left, three touch and go. All right, well, your dampener is away before the checks are complete. Eagle two, short approach is approved until further advice. Short approach approved, until further advice. Eagle two, thanks so much. Minimums, minimums. Landing. Touch tower, riddle 14 at St. Matthews inbound. Information November, full stop. Riddle 14, press tower, and a right down on runway three right. Right down and three right, riddle 14. 100, 50, 40, 30, 20, 10. Greased it. Speed breaks out. Parking. Uh, we're going to the FBO. Citation 2, Roman Fox. Uh, turn right, when able, contact ground 121.7. Alright, uh, right, when able, and going to ground 2, Roman Fox. Uh, thanks, see ya. And no point hitting the brakes, got plenty of runway. Should we clear right, clear left? We are clear to the whole short bars. And lead it up. Alright, let's go to ground. Ground hello, citation to Romeo Fox. Start with clear runway uh, three right for the FBO. Citation uh, to Romeo Fox start for us to ground uh, turn right and take the delta crossway three zero Yeah, coming in super scratchy. Yeah, you said can you say that again? There's two Romeo Foxtrot, taxi via Delta, cross runway 30 at Delta. Okay, uh, FBO via Delta, cross runway uh, 30 at Delta, two Romeo Foxtrot, thank you. Alrighty, Delta, and we're good across the runway to the FBO. Beautiful. Alright, after landing, speedos are off, flaps are up. That's good. Windshields are off. All anti ice switches are off. Amazing. Well, everyone, welcome to Prescott, uh, Arizona. Hope you enjoyed that uh, flight. It was really cool for me personally and hope it came across in the videos. And thanks so much 
to everyone for all your support. It means the world. Really appreciate it. Have a great uh, rest of your week, weekend, whatever day it is. We'll see you on the next one. Take care.